Hi, boys and girls, and welcome to Learning with Miss Nancy. And as you can see, I have a different background. I'm sitting in front of my Christmas tree. Are you enjoying your Christmas holidays? Did you get all of your presents from Santa? I have a Santa Claus here too. Say hello, Santa. Santa's tired because he gave out all of his presents all over the world. And he stopped by my house just to have a chat and just to watch Learning with Miss Nancy. So I'm going to let Santa take a little rest because he's so tired. Take, you, take a rest, Santa. Okay? So, today we're going to talk about sentences. And if, you, if you've seen my last video, I gave examples of sentences and I defined what a sentence is. A sentence is a group of words that express a complete thought. It begins with the capital letter and ends with the punctuation mark. You like that? Yes. So a sentence is a group of words that express a complete thought. A sentence begins with a capital letter and ends with a punctuation mark. Here's an example of a sentence. My fat is cat. What? My fat is cat? Well, is that a sentence? Now let's think about the definition. A sentence is a group of words. So we have a group of words, my fat is cat. Okay, so it's a group of words that express a complete thought. Let's think about the thought. My fat is cat. Mm, it's not a complete thought. It begins with the capital letter. So it begins with the capital letter M. So that's the first word, my, and ends with the punctuation mark, and it ends with the period. Well, the only problem with this sentence is that it's not a sentence. It's just a group of words that starts with a capital letter, ends with a punctuation mark, but it doesn't make sense and it's just a group of words. So this is not a sentence. Let's try this one. My cat is fat. Yes, this is a sentence. It's a group of words and it has a complete thought, a thought that makes sense and a thought that you can understand. The other phrase that I gave you wasn't a sentence at all, just a group of words. A sentence is a group of words that express a complete thought. It begins with a capital letter and ends with the punctuation mark, right? My cat is fat. There's a group of words, a complete thought. It makes sense. It begins with a capital letter. So the word my, the first letter of the sentence must be capitalized. So that M in my is capitalized and ends in the punctuation mark. And there's the punctuation mark, a period. Right. So when you think of punctuation marks, depending on the type of sentence, You'll have various marks to uh, end the sentence. Some sentences end with a period, just like the sentence I just showed you. Some sentences end with a question mark because it's a sentence that's asking a question. And then there are some sentences that end with an exclamation mark. That means it shows excitement of some sort, surprise of some sort. The house is on fire. That would end with an exclamation mark. Today's my birthday. That would end with an exclamation mark. Are you my friend? Let's ask him a question. So it would end with a question mark. How old are you? That's a sentence that asks a question and it would end with a question mark. My name is Miss Nancy. So that would end with a period because it's just telling you something. I have a YouTube channel. That would end with a period because it's just telling you something. Let's sing our song together. 
A sentence is a group of words that express a complete thought. It begins with the capital letter and ends with the punctuation mark. Isn't that easy? All right, so let's look at another sentence. Let's see if you can get it. Let's see if it's a sentence. All right, let's see. I'm going to try to trick you. See if I can trick you. He nice very is. Is that a sentence? Well, let's see. It's a group of letters. I mean, it's a group of words. Begins with a capital letter, he. The first letter is ca capitalized, the H. It ends in a punctu uh, period, the punctuation mark. So it's telling you something. But let's look at the sentence again. He nice very is. Does anyone speak like that? Does anyone talk like that? He nice very is. If someone said that to you, you'd say, what are you talking about? Because they're not making sense. It's not a sentence. It's not a complete thought. But let's say, he is very nice. Well, this is a sentence. It begins with a capital letter. It's a group of words that express a complete thought and it ends with a period, a punctuation mark. He is very nice. So if someone says that to you in a sentence, you can understand exactly what the person is saying because they're using a complete sentence. It makes sense when you hear it, when you read it, when you write it, we speak in sentences, we write in sentences, we read in sentences, and we text in sentences. He is very nice. And it ends with the punctuation mark, a period. So, a sentence is a group of words that express a complete thought. It begins with the capital letter and ends with the punctuation mark. Remember that. <laughs>